What is up guys, we are playing with Subheroes Deskbot deck once again. I think maybe we'll do um, two more of these next week and then I don't know. But it's, it's, it's been nice taking a break from doing the main deck every day. So yeah, that's awesome. So uh, Subhero told me to make a little bit of changes, taking a Coral Dragon and Puzzle for Horus and Armory Arm. Um, he did specify that he also added an Axel and Jet Synchron, however, I'm not sure what to take out, so I, I replaced the 6 with the 6, and I replaced the 4 with the 4. Um, so, well, let's see how it goes. Um, he also told me to add Ghost Ash and Beautiful Spring, because it's amazing. It is fucking amazing. So, without further ado, let's get into the duels. I forgot to do the thingy with the rock, paper, scissors. Uh, let's see, what can I do? Uh, I can put you in the extra deck. Mm. Special summon an ancient gear. And get that box. Get that lovely little box. Because we can go catapult. Catapultation. Special summon wyvern. Because wyvern is awesome. And then we can use its effect to get box into hand. And then we can pendulum summon, which is awesome. Everything is fucking awesome. So we're going to go ahead and add... Um, do, oh yeah, I need a low scale. So we're going to go ahead and add two. I mean, six. I can, I can numbers. I know numbers, okay? Just numbers, yeah. So we're gonna go ahead and activate that six. Yeah, beautiful Despot six. And then we'll normal summon Despot three. Yes, I'd like to use your effect. And to get a two. Um, we will special summon that two to the field. Brilliant, pre prime, pristine, Despot two. To get another two in hand. And then we will just go off. We will go ahead and summon out four and another two. So that two will hit the field. Boom. That four will hit the field. Boom. And yes, two's effect will trigger. How I love for two's effect to trigger. And we'll get a five. So we're basically cycling through our deck like mad right now. So let's go for the Herald of Awesomeness in defense mode. Uh, as for cards, I want to add the back. Uh, we will go for Gigigant X as well. And then off Gigigant X, we can go plus... Well, I think plus. Uh, I want you in my hand. Now, as for what I can add... Oof. Do I want... I think I want to go for Synchros for once. Um, but what do I add? Because I can easily normal... So yeah, I'll get the Teratop, because why not? Because just in case it clears my field as well... Um, I don't want it to be so much of a problem if he does clear my field. So we're going to add you back to the hand. And we're going to put box back in deck. And that should be it for the turn. Um, so hopefully we can do some crazy shit. We can't summon that mic back, which kind of sucks. Because desk box are like, you can only a special, you can only pendulum shokan the desk of bots. But we have Teratop here as our contingency plan, because this field is vulnerable. And one for one, are we up against DDDs? Yes, we are. We are up against DDDs. So we can easily as well go into a break sword, which I have no problem with. So you're gonna add that beautiful, that beautiful ASDAR contract from your deck. And what are you gonna do with that dark contract? Obviously, he's gonna search with it. If only I had the thingies, the the spring. Yes, the spring, the the beautiful spring in hand. That would have made my hand amazing. Oh, so amazing! My hand would have been very good. But now it's not because I don't have the winter cherries, the zombie, the fire zombie that could probably do something in Shiranui's later along the line. Cause it's also a tuna. But I'm going to see some crazy plays here. He actually normal summoned the Lamia. Yeah, as a first. But 
Crystal Wing is going to be a problem. And I can see clearly now he can go into Crystal Wing and do some damage. However, Crystal Wing will not save you. It will not save you from your fate. If only I had Maxi, that would have been delicious. But Crystal Wing will still not save you from your fate. Hmm. Okay, so let's see what's going to fusion summon. Probably the Ark or Timogen. Yeah, it's going for Timogen because he has Necro Slime and Grave. Uh, we are about to see a big board here. Because DDDs are pretty fucking strong. So we are going to see a big board. Yes, we are. So now he's gonna go. He went for Slime's Effect. Banish those for D Arc. What are you gonna bring back though? You can bring back Lamia. And Lamia would be a good thing to bring back. Hmm. I'm actually quite concerned. Okay, he's going for the Lamia. Which is okay. But he is clearing my board, which means I can go Terra Top. And I can use Break Sword to fuck up his shit. If only I could get more searches. Oh wait, I can. And then I can go into CDI. Okay, because I can pop you with uh, um, Le Break Sword and pop something on his field. That is very important to him. So at this moment, he's going to go for Alexander. Okay, Curse King Alexander gonna hit the field. Oh shit, he is going to go for Crystal Wing. Um, so he's gonna discard the Dark Contract with the Witch. Which... Would be bad for me. Get it? Ha ha ha. My jokes are horrible. Yes, they are. So, now what? This field is going to be pretty unstoppable if I don't do something. I can make Clear Wing, which can negate Crystal Wing, but then Crystal Wing can negate the Clear Wing. Um, that's a tough one. What do I do against this field? Um, because he's gonna go, f he's obviously going for Crystal Wing here. And I can't really do too much about it. Which kind of sucks. Huh. I'm actually pretty stumped on what to do. Hopefully he tries to negate Terratop. Because that would be very unfortunate if you had to, if, um... Wait, Crystal Wing, uh, it's any monster's effect, so it doesn't matter. Because Crystal Wing can negate it. Oh wait, shit, he wouldn't have gained. Because it has to be 5 or higher, then he gains it. Damn it, I am a dumb. That, that is true, I am a dumb. Because Crystal Wing couldn't gain as well. Um, but, there, okay, my field is not completely gone. So I do have some plays in store for this guy. And he's got back row as well, so what do we draw? We drew a three. That is awesome. We drew a three. Now we can pendulum summon, but first we'll go for Gig Gigant X to get rid of the four. Because four is an out to Crystal Wing as well. Are you gonna negate it? Are you gonna negate it? Are you gonna negate it? Tell me now, are you going to negate it? Um, he's not negating it. What do I do now? He's not engaged. He's not engaged. Words come out of my mouth. Please. Yes, box. I will use you to go plus. You gonna negate it? You gonna negate it? Please negate it. Please, please, my friend. Please negate it. So that I can do stuff. Okay, he's not negating it. So box is going to add me another five. Um, so how are we gonna do this? Box will add me another five. We will break, try to, we'll attempt to break sword the crystal. That, that's the main plan. Because we have box in hand. We'll attempt to break sword the crystal wing. And then we should be fine from around, from there about. So we'll go for the terra top. If he negates, then he negates. So Takitambo gonna hit the field. We had the three, we could have done something else, but I think this is how we get rid of Crystal Wing. So we're gonna go ahead and hit that Takitamborg, that beautiful Takitamborg on the field. And then we can go into Breaksword. So Breaksword will hit the field. And then... 
As much as I want to pendulum summon first and take out his back row, uh, I can't. It's not really something I want to do. Um, let me check my grave quickly. Um, how do I? Uh, that's my extra deck. <sighs> oh shit. So, how do I check my grave? The extra deck. Monster zone. Their graveyard. What's my graveyard? Okay, I have a Despot 2 in grave. So, we will pop the 5. And we will try and... We'll attempt to pop the Crystal Wing. Okay, so he's gonna go ahead and negate it. Which is brilliant. Because now that he's negated Crystal Wing, we can get rid of it. So now, let's go for the Pendulum Summon. Boom. And boom? Should I go for the three? I don't see much of a point in going for the three at the current moment. So we're gonna go five and five. Now, wh what can we do? We can take out all his back row. All your back row are belong to us. All your back row are belong to us, mate. Dimensional barrier, damn you! Uh, he called Pendulum. Okay. Um, I don't have an issue with you dimensional barriering me like that. So, we can go ahead and do this. And then we can go ahead and do this. And then we can go ahead and take the crystal wing. And we can run over the D-Arc. And that should be fine. Because this deck still amazing. We can run over the D-Arc. I'll leave the... Should I take out the Copernicus or the Formula? I think it's a better idea for me to take out the Copernicus. Because that's easy rank 4. But that's the extent of what I can do this turn. Luckily, um, we're in the driver's seat again of this game. So hopefully we got this. We got this. Baby, we got this. Oh, fuck no. Oh, fuck no. No. Out of all things, no. No. No! Oh shit, he can fuse. He can fuse. That's an issue. But we can summon out four. Uh, I'd much rather let him fuse than summon out four. Because he can fuse. Yeah, there's not much he can do at this point, which is fine. So, yeah. Yeah, mate, you can fuse. You can fuse all you want. Just fuse. That D barrier though, I remember getting screwed over at, with a D bar from a D barrier at BCT. Um, I was playing um, a scrub deck because I don't have cards in real. Well, I do have cards in real life. It's just I I've never played meta before, and I don't believe I can do meta as well because I can't afford it. Okay, this shit soul slime. Okay, we m we're in a lot of trouble. I think this is game. As much as I didn't want to have to negate that, I I kind of had to. Uh, this is actually game. Well, GG. That was still a cool duel. That comeback ability, though, he's probably he's gonna take. Um, I take the Gear Gigant because that's more damage. But I won't be surviving this, I think. So that preempt that GG might have been a little preemptive. Nope, I could not survive it. But this deck is still pretty fun to play, and I suggest you guys play it as well if you want to. Um, so we're gonna lose to that Siegfried. I think we should have summoned the three. Oh well, that was still fun. Well then, DDDs, DDD is too strong. No, but honestly, we ha we had them on the ropes. It's just the fact that they can use their grave is kind of nuts. I am building DDD structure deck, the DDD from the structure deck and the cards I have as well. So I should be able to build a pretty decent deck. Um, however, um, we could not stand up to that fusion that just equipped my infinity. But that was really, that was really good. Well played, well played. Um, don't forget to like and subscribe, as well as clicking on ads helps me out a, a quite a bit. This is Kenji Wajio signing in, and I'll see you in the next one. Bye!